Hey everybody, Frugal Farmer here. I've put the post in, got it level. You have to level a post two ways. You have to le level it on the side here and right here. If not, it, it can go one way or the other. And I got these spare boards. I've been using them. I used them when I had to move my mailbox. And that was a whole big drama. The, they quit bringing my mail because one of the mail people who was a substitute carrier couldn't get to my box and the lady said well you have to have it so anybody can get to it I said well if they're driving a school bus or f-150 I said I can't do that so we came up met out here at my house and came up with a happy meeting place so I still had to move my mailbox but anyway back to this post this is my first fence post I was going to dig the other one but man that dig <laughs> that, sh that shovel ain't user friendly that's for sure but I only have two of these two by fours to keep it steady and I'll keep it like this overnight. And what I'll do, you see one of my bars sticking out and uh, I didn't come all the way up to the top because I wanted to be able to pour my water in there and have it sit and not run off and go through the cement. I had one cement bag that was had solidified. It wasn't mine, it was a friend of mine and his wife stayed with me for a while, supposedly to help me out, but it's, uh, it tore up more than I can get back together and mess up stuff and it was a bag he left out in the rain and so I was able to bust it apart and drop that in there and by the time my loose cement solidifies around all that it'll just add weight to that one side since the gate's going to be coming off this side and that'll help counterbalance it and uh, I'll put a top on there and uh, so rainwater won't sit on top of the post and make it look a little bit better. I'll take and route it off and I have it look decent up there. And uh, on the other side, I'll put some more no trespassing signs. So I'll have one, two, three, four, five, six, about eight no trespassing signs. And uh, maybe people will get the message at that point. But I am done for the day. I'll put some more cement on it tomorrow and cover it up with dirt. It's been raining here. I think it's stopping. I wish it'd rain on through the night and saturate my cement, but I poured a pretty good sized bucket of water on there, so it'll solidify where I can take put the other post down maybe tomorrow. And uh, you know, I'll drill them out here and get the gate started on them because I wanted to have them up. That way I could get my gate. Uh, gate measurement right and uh, I'll be able to gate my property then and that'll be big relief in North Carolina just a little tidbit of information if you have a closed gate you don't have to have the first trespass and sign up if somebody without permission drives around your gate or open your gate and goes in that is a trespass now most trespassing laws are if you go on the property if it's not posted you have to you have to leave my property and if you don't leave then you're guilty of trespass and uh i've got a story i'm gonna do on the instant i had the other day and uh about this this is the reason the gates are going up right now but i'll have that up as soon as i get the gates up i'll have that video ready to go thanks for stopping by come back again when you will share comment like hit that subscribe button god bless